There we go. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video. This is a surprise. Right now, I am not live streaming. I'm about to live stream in a little while, but I'm in Europe trying to level up my warrior to level 90. I have to level them up before the, the next patch, which is patch 5.2. And in order to do that, I'm going to have to try to get to level 15 so I can do instances. But as you can see, there's nobody around because nobody knows I'm here. Only a couple people know I'm here. They've been whispering, but if I live stream it, there's no way I'm going to be able to do any of these quests. So right now I'm going to do a couple quests, get to level 15, and then the XP is going to start. Because right now I have a recruiter friend on both these accounts. I'm dual boxing by the way, look, I'm on my druid. Oh yes, on my druid and on my warrior. Playing both tunes at the same time. I'm using I'm using a, a macro actually on my uh, orb weaver. I hit one tap, one button and it taps between the two instances as well. It's actually just a macro alt tab. I have a setup. Whoa! There's my light. There we go. And I have macros set to follow. Um, for example, my druid right now. Follow. See? Follow. Bam. <laughs> set on auto follow. I have to keep running around with my XP bonus. I need my bonus. So I go here, bam, and I attack target. Start DPSing on my warrior. Let's do this. Uh oh! People found me! They found me. Uh oh. If this keeps happening, I will not be able to continue my quests. What do I need? I need a trophy fill. Right. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Wait, guys, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let me level up and then. Let me do this. Oh, oh, oh. Trying to help. I just gotta make sure. Just gonna make sure they don't actually tag, tag my my mobs. It'll be up. By the way, I'm gonna be doing instances like this. I'm gonna be dual boxing. Hopefully, people won't realize that I'm tanking and I am also healing. <laughs> and it's gonna be very easy to get uh, to get cues because I'm a tank and a healer. So all I need is you know just a couple DPS. So. By the way, my name on on Europe is the name of my warrior. His name is Swiftality. I'm also creating a tune on US. I'm going to create a monk on US. And I'm actually going to grind that one to level 90 before the patch hits. Think it's impossible? It's not impossible. I have recruit a friend bonus. And I'm going to be getting help from, uh, from my friends. Hotted's going to help me power level from 80 to 85. He knows a couple tricks. So that's what I'm going to be doing. On both US and on Europe. My goal, my goal is to have four playable characters level 90 as soon as the patch hits two warriors one on europe one on us uh, of course my druid and and then a monk i'm gonna i'm gonna level up a monk on us all right we'll see if i can do this at level 10 oh more people are showing up no 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 i gotta try to get this done as quickly as i can at least they're not tagging the mobs which is cute <laughs> It's pretty good. Once you get the macro set, it's it's pretty easy. Is this cheating, guys? This is not cheating. This is multi-boxing next level. <laughs> you know how long it would take me without recruiter friend bonus? It, I couldn't do it. Like, I, I don't have the time. By doing this, I'm going to be gaining... I don't know. We'll see. I, I think I'm going to be gaining about three to four levels per instance run, which is awesome. That's quick. That's power leveling. I like it. The hardest part, I think, is going to be from level 80, um, from 85 to 90. Because from 80, all, Recruit Friend Bonus works all the way up to level 80. But from 80 to 85, I can get power leveled by Hotted in 45 minutes. He knows, he knows an area where I can go. From 85 to 90, I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to have to grind it. 85 to 90, I think it took me on live, on my main, I think it took me like two to three days. So, hopefully there's a, there's a, there's a quicker way, we'll see. Nice. Now some of you might say, Swifty, why don't you use the actual dual boxing program? 
I know because there, there, there's a, a dual boxing program that lets you, you know, play on one tune and then it throws commands to the basically the other one. The problem with those programs is I don't want to risk, you know, getting banned for for something for, for for using those types of programs. Now, supposedly they tell you that those programs are safe. Of course, those those companies will tell you those programs are safe. You won't get banned for using them, but you never know. You're using a third-party program. Who knows? I might get in trouble, and I can't get in trouble because this is what I do for a living, guys. Like I play World of Warcraft. I can't risk getting banned, so I play it safe. Like I'm very careful with the mod, the mods that I use, and I'm very careful with uh, you know third-party programs that that are that you use to help you play the game. I don't use them. So it's for me, it's just alt tabbing, and once I alt tab, then I control. I should totally control the other two. And just by pressing follow, I think that's fine. I don't think that's cheating at all. <laughs> as a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, I used to run around with my warrior, and I had my druid on auto follow, and I would switch to my druid to to throw out heals on my warrior <laughs> and CCs. It's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. PVP and like that. I, I I have footage of that. It's old footage, but I have footage of doing that multi boxing like that. It's a lot of fun. Now I used to I actually got away with it in arenas too. I used to do 2v2 arenas, but that was back when druid heals were a little bit stronger than they are now. Stronger compared to like uh, like you wouldn't get blown up. You could you could throw hots on yourself as a druid way back then when and uh, you wouldn't die. Nowadays you just get blown up <laughs> as a druid. Can't do that. I can't multi box on my druid. I'll just you just, you'll just get blown up. All right, we're done. I think we're done with all the quests. Let me see. Yep. About to turn in a whole bunch of quests, which should level me up. I have recruit friend bonus. Come on, pretty kitty. That's the name of my druid alt, pretty kitty. And he's the one who's going to boost me, boost me to level 90. Because I don't like leveling up. I don't like the grind. I like anything that makes it my job a, a lot easier is better. If I could put heirloom items on this character, I would. I don't have them. And that would increase the process even more. The good thing on on USA is that I have access to all the heirloom items, and on, on the, my US account, I'm going to be leveling up uh, a monk. And the monk, the monk, I already have it recruited friended with another monk. And the monk gets like they have like a daily quest buff that increases like XP gains too. And I think they stack. I think they stack with everything. So heirloom, recruit a friend, monk buff. I'm going to level so fast on your on, on US, but that's going to be, I'm going to do that at almost at the same exact time. T today, I'm just going to be grinding this on the live stream, and probably tomorrow I'll probably grind up my, my monk. We'll see how far I can get. Nice, pretty fires, pretty fires. Look how beautiful this looks. Look how beautiful this area looks. It is awesome. <laughs> Someone's asking, I want to see your live stream. Where can I find it? You will find it soon, my friend. Ancestors watch over. Oh, I leveled up. Oh, level nine. Level nine. Ooh. How may I eat you? Guys, seriously, if I was live streaming right now, I could not do this. <laughs> There's no way. Level nine on my druid. All right. All right. Um, do we have another quest? Well met. No. Just make it short. Oh, wrong tune. All right. Be careful. <laughs> oh my goodness. I know it took a long time, guys, but now I finally have the time to do this. Be careful. I my goal is to do it before the patch, so I, I, I want to get to ninety because once you get to ninety it's gonna be very, very easy to get gear. Of course, you can just grind the gear with honor. All the P all the, the the arena items right now you can you can grind them next patch with honor which is going to be amazing so i'm going to be able to grind out all my epics now weapon i don't know weapon i think they're going to restrict the weapons but maybe not maybe i'll be able to get a weapon i'm not i'm not sure about that cuz i know for a warrior as a warrior the weapon is the most important thing but since they removed the 2200 cap it's going to be just a matter of time to get gear I'm gonna see if I can get into some good R. Oh my god, I have to go around the lake. I'm gonna see if I can get into some good RBG groups. 
uh, on EU. That would be awesome. Because I know for a fact, you know, RBG gives you a lot more XP, you know, uh, conquest points than, uh, than arenas. I would definitely prefer RBGs over arenas. <laughs> but I definitely want to do our arenas too for fun. Because since they removed the, since they removed the, the, the cap, the 2200 cap on arenas, what that means is that a lot of people are going to be playing in arenas. It's going to be insta queue fest. Threes, twos, fives. It's going to be all insta queues. Insta queues. Because so many people are going to be playing. It's going to be awesome. And I'm super looking forward to that. And no one's going to sit on 2200 anymore. Oh my god. Guys, do you know what that means? Do you know what that means? People aren't going to sit on 2200 rating anymore. I was one of them. I was one of them. I used to like I used to do threes, get to 2200, and sit on that rating for like two months until I got all my 2200 gear. Because if you were to lose a game, you couldn't get the gear anymore. So you you basically had to sit on 2200 rating. There were so many inactive teams in the 2200 bracket; it was ridiculous. But that's gonna stop now. Now that there's no you know there's no rating requirement for the weapons, now it's gonna be awesome. I I'm telling you. It's going to be insta -Q fest. It's going to be awesome. Alright, what am I supposed to do here? Turn in a quest. Oh, great. I have to fight these things. Fight! Thank you so much for killing these things. Kill it! 